Hello everyone, um, so it's Friday. I had a pretty um, crappy day at work today and so I decided that I would try to distract myself by making a weekend reading vlog. Um, and so now I'm just going to try to relax and uh, listen to some nice music, some chill music, and get and have some quality time with me and my books. Um, it's around 95 degrees here in Germany and I don't have air conditioning so I'm a bit really sweaty and red but um, that doesn't affect my reading so I don't really care. Um, so uh, my reading plan for this weekend is to try and finish all three of these books. Um, I'm about halfway through The Sun and Her Flowers by Ruby Kaur. Um, I read Milk and Honey yesterday, no, the day before yesterday, and I really enjoyed that, and I'm enjoying The Sun and Her Flowers as well. I actually quite like her longer poems. Um, I f it, they're a bit more intriguing, and I like having that, like, length. And I'm about 50 pages into Persepolis uh, by Marjan Satrapi. Um, I really like this as well. I, unfortunately, <laughs> as part of university, saw the film last week, and I was only five pages, uh, 50 pages in, but, um, I'm sure that I'm going to enjoy the graphic novel just as much as I enjoyed the film. I, I'm looking forward to that as well, and then I would like to get to the two short stories, um, from Kendar Blake and the Queens of Fenburn. So I think that's pretty manageable, and I'm looking forward to it. So I think tonight I will try to finish The Sun and Her Flowers. Um, it's about a quarter to nine at the moment. Um, the sun is still out, but I think, um, yeah, I think I'll finish it uh, tonight. So I'll update you later. Hello everyone. Um, it's about an hour later, and I finished The Sun and Her Flowers. I really, really enjoyed it. Um, I um, really, really enjoyed all of her poems about um, immigration, about what she said about her mother and women and um, loss and loving yourself and all of that stuff I thought was really, really powerful in this collection. I would highly recommend both of these poetry collections, even though I don't read a ton of poetry. I think they're very accessible and um, beautiful and well written so I really enjoyed that. I think I'm gonna head to bed and try to start tomorrow off motivated, um, do some uni university stuff and uh, finally get some food for my fridge and for my belly. So yeah. Hi, um, it's Saturday. It's about mm, almost 11 actually. I got up a little later than I was planning on, and I went grocery shopping, tidied the house a bit, and by house I mean my apartment. Um, yeah. So, it's a bit later, but I've decided to treat myself to a bit of reading. I'm gonna, uh, try to make some headway in Persepolis. Um, like I said, I actually saw the movie last week, so, um, I kind of know the basic plot points, but um, I'm really looking forward to actually reading it and consuming it in its original medium. It's a graphic novel. Um, yeah, I'm about 50 pages in, and I will update you guys later. Hello, it's many hours later. I've showered, I'm in real clothes, um, and I've read about 100 more pages of Persepolis. Um, I'm I have about 200 pages left, um, and I'm going to try to finish it today. So I'm going to try to read a book a day this weekend. That's my new goal. Um, university stuff has not been successful because my printer is acting up and being weird, but um, what are you going to do about it? Hello everyone, um, it's actually Monday morning and I totally forgot to update or film anything yesterday. I just forgot I was doing it, but I did get to uh, some reading. I finished 
I read the last 100 pages of Persepolis on Sunday and the complete um, Queens of Fenburn. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. I mean, it's a, I never know with fantasy. Um, but that was really good. It was two short stories. Um, one about the three queens from the series when they were really little and one about an oracle queen. Um, so I would recommend it if anybody wants to um, yeah, go back to that world while we're waiting for the third book. Um, for those of you who don't know, uh, it's a fantasy series and the it, it's on an island and uh, every queen has triplets and they have magical abilities. Um, either they are resistant to poison, they have elemental magic or uh, natural magic. And when they're 16, all three queens have to battle it out. And whoever kills the other two becomes the next reigning queen. So it's pretty badass. Um, so I did it. I, I read three books in three days. I'm very excited. I liked all of them. Um, yeah. And I hope next weekend I can get some more reading done. So thank you for watching. Have a great week. Happy reading. Bye.